I'm going to take Nick Robinson's rhombic unit, uh, which I've already shown how to fold. I'm going to unfold it and use it to make something else. I don't need all of the folds that are used to make the rhombic unit, but it's a little easier to start from here. I need to make one extra fold to make the thing I want to make, and that is I need to fold it in half the other way. And it's very important to fold it. See how these face inwards? We want to turn it over and fold it in the opposite direction. Like that. So what we're going to do is we're going to arrange it so that this is pointing downwards like that. And we're going to bring together some various pieces of this. So this triangle here, we're going to bring these two parts of the triangle together and we're going to take them closed like that. And over on the other side, we're going to bring these two parts of the triangle together and we're going to tape them closed. Now eventually we are going to bring these together as well and make a little pyramid, but we're just going to deal with the bottom of that pyramid next. So it would be useful to hold that together while we deal with the bottom. Now you'll see that these pieces here will fold flat on top of that. And this edge here will go flat against that edge there, but you are going to have to make one extra fold to be able to close it up. And we're going to do it over the other direction as well. This comes down to be flat along here. This crease here becomes flat along that edge and holding it there we're going to have to fold that down. And now finally I can bring this down. And I'll just tape that down. And this down and they should meet together in the middle like that and I'll tape that down too and I might just for completeness sake do these two sides as well and now what we've managed to make is a pyramid but the remarkable thing about this pyramid is I can open it up and create a different pyramid both of these pyramids, 12 of them will fit together to make a rhombic dodecahedron. These 12, the faces of the rhombic dodecahedron are these rhombuses. And these 12, six of them fit together to make a cube. And if you put the um, six more on the outside of the cube, it makes a rhombic dodecahedron as well.